Thank you for my short presentation on Nazi science from the 1920s to 1945 and beyond. All research based on coal liquefaction to oil. Everything starts with liquid fuels. I'm 45 Soriano, your host. The fischer tropes reaction, coal liquefaction, liquid fuels, gasoline, diesel fuel, lubricating oils, all alternative energy research and development based on cheap liquid fuels. The research continued well after the end of World War II and on to this present day from bases in Antarctica and South America. fischer tropes technology, coal gasification, natural gas, methane, and with proper catalyst conversion into the liquid fuels. Modern plant in a base in Argentina, decades ahead of anything else on this planet. A German UFO, Luftboot or flying boat, Foo Fighter, flying saucer, alternative means, unconventional means of propulsion, but all applications based on research using cheap liquid fuels. Here we see a synthetic gasoline being shipped to the front from a fischer tropes plant in Germany. And here's one of the original plants photographed in the late 1930s. The Allies were in awe of the technology. Operation Paperclip, Werner von Braun and some of the other German scientists were uh, brought to the United States some against their will taken to the Soviet Union and others made it to South America. Here we see a flying saucer, Czechoslovakia, 1945, upper left corner. A V-2 rocket actually entered space. Space-time continuum, and this is Fisher and Tropes, whose research in the 1920s propelled the German war effort. Antarctic base here in the lower left, a U-boat entering a portal and a German jet from uh, just a number of years ago. Development of the base in Argentina, Avril 7 German UFO, here we see a uranium bomb. The Germans were just months away from having one, and there were plans to drop one on Manhattan Island. Reconnaissance, late 1944. The Germans were just 12 miles off of Manhattan Island. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed this brief presentation.